Shalom from Israel. I hope everybody's doing really well. I want to thank you for having me uh, greet you from this wonderful place. We're in Tel Aviv right now. I've been working with a wonderful team of people on this day where we're going to spend uh, time learning about communities of practice. And thankfully we have technology to bring us together. Although I'm not physically present with you, I am thinking about you. And today we have learned some things about the way Israelis perceive communities of practice. Stay tuned. <laughs> Give an answer about uh, what is community in practice. Madam, what do you mean, Manny? How to describe them? Like, I'm, like I told you, I, it's pretty difficult to be even in Hebrew like, to think about it, how to describe community in practice. What is a community of practice? To tell you the truth, I have no idea. Okay, this is quite difficult, but um, communities in practice. Uh, first of all, I never quite understood the word practice. Community of what? You have two words, community and practice. There is a combination between the community and the practice. So you need to define this community. To have the practice, as I said, for um, a lawyer practice. So someone is doing their job and they are practicing something. And you have the practice of, for example, studying something and, and you need to practice something to be good at. Community in practice. Community in practice is when a community uh, practices how to be a community. Perhaps. So I hope we all walk away from today with a greater understanding of what communities of practice can be, or what we can walk away with both for ourselves uh, as empowered individuals and as people who can facilitate and be part of communities of practice so that we can all learn more and more together. I look forward to this year where we'll be able to continue learning about this wonderful subject and I hope everybody's doing well. Enjoy the rest of your summer.